Willkommen zurück, meine lieben Freunde. Ich bin so euer lieber Udo bei Disco Illusion. Ähm, letztes Mal haben wir Ruby das Dorf verfolgt. Die, die darin und jetzt fangen wir gerade herum. Wir haben da drinnen ein zauberndes, entzückendes kleines Mädchen getroffen. Ähm, wir werden jetzt nochmal mit ihren Brüdern sprechen, ob die diese Ruby gesehen haben. The scruffy haired little boy kicks a stone while the other watches him do it. Okay, is little Lily your sister? Yes. 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 That's it. You're being laconic about it. It doesn't look like he knows what that means. Kids, have you seen any bad people around? What bad people? I don't think questioning four-year-olds without their parents present is going to crack the case. Hmm. Bye, kids. Take care. Ja, aber drinnen bei dem Mädchen hast du mitgemacht. Na gut, schauen wir mal, ob wir die Mutter finden. Irgendwo müsste die ja sein. Oder da drüber? A drop in temperature. An easy flow of air, an empty street, before you, a thoroughfare, unjammed with lorries. No more drivers smoking on hitch steps. Just silence. What did the smoke smell like? Chemically sweetened. Across the road, a forgotten bus stop. Corrosion has opened a hole in its roof. An elm tree watches over the building. Its branches are dripping with rain and snow. Okay. The road is smooth and motley. Craters filled with a black asphalt. The asphalt first laid is grey already. A row of tenements are under construction in the distance. Who are the people who live at the road? A tub warm with water, white with soap. A man bathes while radio waves transmit the lottery numbers. Four, eighteen, twenty-one, four, one. A modern washing machine rattles a drawer full of silverware. Okay. His boyfriend is on his way home. He brings tins of meat and vegetables with him. Their pockets are heavier with money, but only slightly. Who are the people? Also, at the bus stop. Number 312D. Young girls used to come here, huddled up, hoping for more warmth than their thin coats give them. The bus took them to school. It has not run for eight years. There were not enough girls to sustain its cost. Hmm. This is not good. Craters popped the surface. Children played in them until heavy trucks full of black pitch rolled in. The landowners have filled the craters with money. It is a vital artery of the flow of trade. Okay. There's one bump on the road. A dead dog lies flat about 200 paces away. Right at the turn. At door. Tragedy comes from the wheels of a fast RCM vehicle hurrying to work. The cold washes over you. The sound of the sea has grown distant. Danke. The wind moves the aerosol. A detective stands behind the boom barrier. A breeze moves a curl of his hair. Oh, die kommen da nicht drauf. Interessant. Das hält uns ab. Echt jetzt? Na gut. Dann gehen wir in diese Richtung mal weiter. Schauen wir mal, irgendwie kommen wir dann da schon raus. Ich bin mir ziemlich sicher. Back at you from the rust colored water. You. Oh. Winter. Slow to let go of Rivershaw. Flex some more wet snow from above. Okay. 
Look around you. The snow falls lazily, making the beach sand paler still, mixing with the rust-colored sewage runoff. It has been a cold year. All things waiting for spring will have to wait a bit longer. Looking up at the sky, melted snow dripping from your hat. What do I see? The sky is full of great battleships. White clouds collide with one another, and the world is drenched with their debris. Okay. How does it feel? The melting snow seeps through your thin clothes. Grandmothers don't let their grandchildren out dress so lightly in this weather. At least your hair is protected from getting wet and sticking together. You look around. Okay. What is in the west, north, south? There is Ruby. What's below me? Layer upon layer of sand, poisoned with industrial runoff. The storm drainage, hidden bunkers. Oh, shit. Rats scuttle. That's King Nickwood. Tell me a secret of the sand. Thing. Someone stuffed a big old polar anorak into a concrete pipe under the boardwalk. It hmm. would keep you warm. You would probably never happen across it. But who knows? What's in the west and in the east? In the the canal you crossed to get here and beyond it. Martinez proper. The district. The police forgot to police. There is laughter. Lights. Attempts at entrepreneurial activity. Cynicism. Hmm. Someone is scraping snow off their windshield. At the roundabout. In the midst of which a statue of Philip III serves as a destination. For grade school field trips and a fine perch for winter birds. Hmm. That's all? Like all monuments, it's also a warning. Six-story ruins on the south side of the roundabout cast a long shadow over the profligate king. Hmm. A fenced-off yard. There's a truck belonging to a logistics company parked next to the gate. Bright light from a building behind the fence reflects of its hood. Okay. Clean white light coming from the windows of a clean cube-shaped office building hidden amidst ruins. A secret. Okay. What does he mean? More winding coastlines lined with abandoned buildings. Crumbling piers, salt water lapping at their dark piles. Grey and red forgotten city blocks. What remains of the pre-revolutionary effort to gentrify the coast? Mm -hmm. The waters turn black. Coal city in the shadow of San Martin. A boom town. Back when coal extracted from countless shafts near the city was needed to power Revachon. Okay, das heißt, Umweltverschmutzung, no more. Dreck. The coal was supplanted by petroleum from the ocean floor and hydropower from the Esperance. Everything crumbled. These days, only the weakest remain in Coal City. Their hopes of getting rich linger in the defunct shafts under their feet. Ah, das klingt nach noch deprimierender als davor. Below the old mines, Losser Municipal, Revachal's underground cemetery. La Petite braved the underground passageways, trying to get to Le Royam. Le Royam. Where the Philippian kings were interred, with their doctors and their admirals. Mausoleums, okay. burial chambers, leaf gold still remains on the double door of the morning. Children here? under 14, they go underground looking for artifacts to sell to foreign museums oh, and for really? fabled relics. Their parents let them, they go deeper. Few Petira return from the shafts. Okay. Even fewer find what they're looking for. A small child steps out of the black tunnel with silver trinkets in her pockets. All around her, white snow on the extinguished coke furnaces and on the weather-worn shacks where fathers beat their sons after drinking. The snow melts on your fingers, turning to water. Okay. 
but was ist im Norden? The abandoned church, one of two remaining stave churches, which were collectively called Le Set Sir. The other six sisters were destroyed during the revolution. Okay. And to the north? A serpentine strip of land weaving its way into the Martinez Inlet. Unfortunates on the run from the law, from themselves, sometimes hide out on nearby islets. Little dots in the ocean that are occasionally submerged when the tide is high and the weather foul. Yeah, and on the islets. The remains of a camp on a jagged piece of rock, a tent, old dishes and cutlery, long since abandoned. A hermit crab scuttles among the debris, looking for a new shell. Further out, the lights burn bright on Resurrection, way beyond Martinez, a popular spa destination for ample-bodied Ozon kids with okay. equally ample pockets. And on the other side of the internet. Then there's Ozon, but the snow falls too thick. You cannot see that far. Hmm. For that, for the curtains are drawn. The Bay of Revachel, vastness, great depth. Over 1200 meters at its okay. deepest. Water, air brinier than here. It is crisscrossed by huge cargo ships bearing company logos. Wild pines, Zam, Morien. And at the farthest reaches of the Bay of Revachol, the shadow of the coalition warship Archer. On perpetual patrol duty, ready to unleash artillery fire. If you were to rise up against the market, you shudder. Hmm. Das könnte sein, dass wir hier genau in der Mitte des Plans sind. The raised motorway, 881, separating Martinez from Jamrock. Vehicles whoosh past one another day and night, while those who reside in the labyrinthine alleyways beneath the motorway attempt to carry on with their lives in the snow and the slush. And south of the 881, is the pox. The pox Klingt nicht was gut. once a park, a place for reflection and recuperation for the patients of the old military hospital. Okay. In the twenties, it was used as a quarantine center during a measles outbreak that killed many children. Most everyone has avoided the hospital and surrounding park ever since. Okay. The pox is completely wild now. Evergreen thickets covered in snow and industrial dust. Feral dogs and even wolves roaming in packs. The police try to keep the deepest corners cordoned off. Okay. But still... Heavy drug users do slip through and hole up in the old military hospital, hoping to find something to get high on among the hastily abandoned supplies or just to overdose in peace. Okay. A line of motor garages with armored carapaces hunched in the cold. A mechanic is hard at work, patching up bullet holes in the side of a Capri 40. These are the garages of Precinct 41. Snow settles on the roof of the repurposed silk mill. It serves as your station. Shivering RCM personnel hurry in and out of the main entrance. Okay. Around you. The snow continues to fall. To the west, the ocean swells. No, it was home. I want home. Look around. A chill comes over you, crawling down your back. The sand under your feet is wet. Somewhere in the south, tarpauling flap in the wind. So we're not like ruby. Oh. Near, snow falls into dark water. She prays, though she doesn't believe. There is a hum in the air. Oh, she's so in the kirche. That's all. Oh, okay. we should keep moving. Who knows when the snow will let up? Tja, wer weiß. Mazut, rust-eaten lettuce, mazut. And I thought the attire of a motor carriage adorns. Hmm. 
What is down here? A little black sh swallow circles above you. You hear it chair up. Oh, there it is. The other was on. That is a mummy. Ah, okay, here come we nicht hin. First responsibility, then stability, then prosperity. Oh, is this the Wappler? Der uns nicht sagen konnte. Ich will mit dem Typ reden. The water runs from the west. A broken pipe. Okay. Hier irgendwie rauf. Aha, okay. Ah, stop. Wir schauen uns mal das da an. No boat in the boat town day. Section of the coasts hasn't been used in decades. Okay. Oh, man kann da reinschauen. Schauen wir mal. Uh, eine neue Brille und Magnesium. Also würden wir Magnesium noch brauchen. Brille, Brille, Brille. Kannst du. Um, is your own Ob Oversized Superstar Sunglass. Großartig. End of Savior Fair und Minus Eins of Cash Visual Calculus. Mirror Lies. Is your own stardom too deadening for you? For your eyes? Can't bear to look at your own a fabulous reflection in the mirror? Then these classic oversized sunglasses are for you. Deadening reflectors. Mirror Lies. Okay. So that. Plus eins auf Logic und minus eins auf Authority. Wie schauen wir denn aus mit... Okay, wir haben... Also, das war das Interfacing und was machst du? Half-Light. Wir uns wieder an. Nein, bleiben wir bei Half-Light. Das Bett aus. Virtus is shoddily constructed. The strong breeze might blow it over. Okay, Geld. Finde ich gut. Oh, ich bin müde. Das war's. Das ist die Episode, die ich heute aufnehme. Ancient paint is beating off the roof of this shaded bench. Okay. Was ist da? A scattering of bullet holes is spread across the cracked wall, reaching from one corner to the other. Okay. Look him, even more bullet holes. Something's definitely gone down there. Hmm. Correct. The density of the bullet holes is unusual. Even in a general average bullet hole frequency in Martinez sense. Grim affairs. Mm -hmm. Meaning this is a lot of bullet holes. Looks like fully automatic rifle fire. Something you don't see these days. Mm. The lieutenant also nods. It is quite a scene. The two of you standing next to the broken wall of an abandoned building, nodding, nodding along. Uh, not even more. Shake your head. He nods 
in agreement. It really is a very serious scene, worth shaking your head over. Don't stop nodding. <laughs> the lieutenant matches your nodding pace. He's a true professional at this. The nodding's reaching critical mass. You can't take this much longer, Captain. Ooh, and you're in sick. Keep nodding, goddammit. Stay the A small bead of sweat runs down the side of the lieutenant's face as he maintains his nodding. Just one more nod. As the lieutenant takes out her handkerchief and softly taps the sweat off his temple, a faint crack echoes through the coast. Abort! Abort! No. Shit, it's too late. Oh shit, fuck Busted hell. the neck, did you? Glad I stopped when I did. My neck was really starting to hurt. Don't worry, little man. Now we should get going. Okay, wir nehmen uns nochmal ein Dings. Sicherheitshalber, weil ich will nicht sterben. <laughs> das ist so dumm. Um, visual calculus bullet holes on the plaza, bullet holes in the backyard. Know about the revolution. Why did many bullet holes? Okay. Warum auch nicht? A row of ghostly shades stand facing the wall. There are oh, many of them. Nein, A dozen at gut. least. The heads lowered and eyes blindfolded. It's quiet. No sound. No movement. Okay. Ten meters away. Other shades are lined up in an orderly manner. Automatic rifles primed. A gust of wind blows by. The coats on the firing squad flap slowly in the breeze. A single person stands on the side. Snowflakes fall on the wooden planks and the surrounding sand dunes, covering the land with the white of innocence. A long time has passed since the moment of this fusillading. Rain and brine have since washed all the blood away. Not a trace remains. What is this? The abundance of bullet holes leads to two options. Either an inordinate amount of executions were performed here, or they did not use a conscience round, where only one soldier has the loaded rifle. Looks like this was a mass execution with everyone fully armed. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I see. Verstehe. Davon habe ich schon irgendwann mal gehört, dass man bei, keine Ahnung, sechs Leuten, die den Typen erschossen haben, nur einer mit einer richtigen Waffe geladen hat. Einer wusste, wer ihn umgebracht hat am Schluss. Look at the people against the wall. A host of men, probably in everyday clothes. Ragged from the conflict and covered in dust. They were not sitting. A common practice for executions in some nations. As demonstrated by the height level of the bullet holes. Mm -hmm. They stand. Facing the wall. It's impossible to discern any details about their personality or background. Yeah. Ordinary people. Familiar. Each and every one of them. Where Comrades. The Forsaken. The wretched who tried to rise against the horrors of the world. Mm. Look at the line Seven of the men soldiers. in combat uniforms and dark coats holding automatic rifles aimed at the people. Soldiers from some side, but from which one? Mm. The commandant, the one who gives the order. Machine gun fire crackling through the air. The lights of the muzzle flashes dancing on his face Kim who was who in I don't know I don't know who died here lined up beside that horrible wall it could have been any of the parties involved in the revolution perhaps the ones executed here were the loyalist conservatives killed by the communists at the start of the civil war <sighs> or it could have been the communists put to death during the last stretch of the conflict by the coalition forces Sure. 
It could even have been the employees of the failed R&D center down the coast, as their building was taken over by the revolutionaries. Or maybe... What about people from the coalition, the so-called moralists? Yeah. It's very unlikely the coalition forces were the ones who died here. They were always the last ones against the wall. <laughs> to be honest, if a coalition member was anyone in this situation, it was a commandant, the superior giving the orders. Hmm. A cold sea wind blows away the figures. Behind this building, the other one, once filled with engineers and designers of Feld Electric, now collapsed and dead, but for some rats. You feel drawn, for some reason, to the faded mural again. This sign says, Entry into An old ticket taker boot no longer in operation. People paid money to park here. No one would pay now. Okay. Das ist sicher der der Typ, den wir aus dem Ding kennen schon. Vielleicht nochmal das Mural anschauen. Dass ich mich dazu. A row of ghostly shades facing the crumbling wall. With another seven shades standing. Okay. A cold sea behind this building. The other. Okay, ja, 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 ja. Dann vielleicht einer auf der anderen Seite dann. The door is not only barred shut, it is in excess. Okay. Machen wir das noch auf. Was ist das? People. Fine people. Okay, come. Or building a hiding place. Could the instigate. Side. So. Show me. Ultimate focus. Minus one perception. Eyes on the road. The small wire framing inside this futuristic looking barn. Gives it the aerodynamic shape of a swoop skier. Skiers, helmet. But none of its protective qualities covers the various ears and eyebrows to bring down the drag. And okay, what can you do? Plus eins of Encyclopedia. Hmm. Oh god. We should be close to me. Na gut, na, egal. Wir bleiben mal bei diesem Mut. Wer weiß, vielleicht ist es später noch nicht, nicht so schlecht, wenn wir das haben. Okay, meine lieben Herrschaften. Da liegt noch Geld. Der Typ. Ich bin mir ziemlich sicher, dass es der Typ As ist. The yep. man turns and greets you with a polite wave. He appears completely at ease, like a common holiday maker. Ah, super. It's the officer. I was not expecting to run into you again, but things have a funny way of turning out, no? Yeah, nicht wahr? What brings you down to the scenic Martinez coast? Actually, I was wondering what you're doing mm. out there. Well, that's très simple. I was visiting the fishing village just north of here. They have applied for a series of microloans to revitalize the old market. And well, I wished to see the situation firsthand. And then, well, I had some extra time on my hands, so I decided to stroll down here. It's quite peaceful, isn't it? Yeah, it's lovely. Yes. There's nothing like a stroll along the coast to lift one's spirits. Do you know there was a mass execution right over really? there? Here? How can you be sure? It's sort of a gift I have. I can reconstruct things that happened in the past. I end detectives. I end detective stuff. One that will 
ovo je skavod in bullet holes. A vi mak vas jeste. A very useful gift for a police detective, I'm sure. Fascinating how much history is contained right here. If only one knows where to look for it. You feel like there's something you could say here. If only you really knew what was going on. Thank you, rhetoric. Actually, there was something else I wanted to ask you about. I'm all ears, officer. I need your help forming a committee. I'm trying to assign la responsabilité. My friend, if it's la responsabilité you're after, I have good news for you. There's no need to form such a committee because it already exists. What's this? God, of course it does. These moral intern types. The Committee de Responsabilité de Reva Scholl. It acts as a sort of clearinghouse for coalition activities. To put it simply, they are the ultimate arbiters of la responsabilité in this part of the world. Okay. Yes, this is just the sort of reasonable authority you're looking for. I would offer to connect you with the committee myself, but alas, I am not actually in Martinez. Nein, sondern... Wo bist du da? What? Where is he then? Thank you, Perception. He's speaking figuratively. He means he's not in Martinez <laughs> in his official capacity. Thank you, Torik, that you have Perception explained. What are you talking about? I'm looking at you right now. I got it. You're only here on personal Precisément. business. Precisément. Officially, I am still in La Delta, preparing for an upcoming conference on fuel oil derivatives. Okay. That's why it would be extremely irregular, or potentially even inappropriate, for me to intercede with the committee concerning a district I'm not officially in. Okay, but this is an urgent matter. I need to get into Yes, okay. you've made your persistence quite clear. Under normal circumstances, I would have to insist you go through the regular channel. No, no. Aber jetzt. You can't let them give you the runaround. Kann ich das nicht? But if you have information of a vital interest, they might be willing to entertain an exception. In which case, I would advise you to contact them via coalition worship archer. Why do I need to go through archer to speak to the committee? You see, in addition to being an airborne artillery platform, Coalition Warship Archer is also the linchpin of the Coalition's surveillance and communications infrastructure in Revachol. Okay. Well, watching us. And listening. It has the most objective vantage point in the entire city. Not to mention a vast array of radio, photographic, and meteorological monitoring instruments. Okay. I find it a great comfort to know there are benevolent powers watching over all, in strict accordance with the Wayfarer Act and the Brüssel-Müne Convention. Ich bin mir ziemlich sicher, dass es nicht mit der DSGVO zusammen uh, zusammenpasst. How does one go about contacting the Coalition mm. Warship? This is quite the problem. Very tricky. Of course, the Archer has orders to fire on any unidentified aerostatics that might approach it. So it might be safer to get in touch from the ground. Okay, das ist zu lang, wenn ich dieses Gespräch. Would require a radio transmitter capable of broadcasting on coalition frequencies, and that kind of technology naturally isn't typically available for non-coalition use. Könnten wir von der Ruby bekommen? Yes, it is a bit of a conundrum. I suppose there might be some way to circuit bend your way onto those frequencies, but you'd have to be one of those techno tinkerers to do it. Do you know any of these tinkerers? Unfortunately not. No. I don't have the pleasure. I am merely a representative of the coalition government. Not very well versed in technology. But you? Ah, good. Techno tinkerers. Just what this side task was missing. <laughs> Let me just say that I have complete confidence in the RCF. I'm sure you'll figure something out. Ah, thank you. That's is super. Gives genau gar nicht. Nicht ein. Always my pleasure to be of assistance to the RCF. Godspeed, and if we don't meet again, bonne chance. 
Okay. Danke, Sunday Friends. Okay. Naja, wie schon gesagt, meine lieben Herrschaften, wir werden Schluss machen für heute. Ich hoffe, es hat euch gefallen. Ähm, wir sehen uns das nächste Mal wieder. Bis dann. Ciao.